Well, welcome back to Dobbo's Fishing Adventures, and here we go again. So, Friday evening, weather is absolutely looking shite for the, uh, the Saturday night, so uh, Friday evening uh, is going to have to be. So, uh, back on the sole, hopefully. I've uh, been fishing a little bit hard in the last couple of weeks, so I've been told, so might struggle tonight. But who cares? Look at this, it's lovely. Absolutely gorgeous. Bit of a westerly, westerly breeze, so that's good. So hopefully that'll hold me uh, where I need to be on the mark. So got back from uh, Weymouth, Bridport, West Bay, Saturday. Had a cracking time there, so that's good. Good to be back at work as well, to be fair. Lots to catch up on. Um, but yeah, all good. And like I said before, it was great to see Alex at Sakuma, Swift Fish and Tackle. Good to meet up finally. So bring it on. So usual tactics tonight. Plenty of absolutely cracking worm from uh, Bill's Bait and Tackle, as always. So we'll just uh, just see what happens tonight. Might be a few of the usual suspects, but. As I say, it's just, it's not fishing nowhere near as what it should be. And I'm not talking about the sole either. I'm talking about just the usual bits and bobs, you know, the shy fish. They just uh, don't seem to be there. So whether they've uh, dredged up through there, which certainly won't help, help matters going for the sole. But yeah, it's very strange. But you've got to be in it to win it. Every night's different, so fingers crossed. Uh, I see something, but if not, it's great to be out regardless. The bonus fish is what we're after, but look at this, beautiful. Nice bit of sunshine coming out in between the clouds, so it's not going to be over hot. We're, uh, well, we're a week before August now, so there's no reason why these soles aren't really showing up. For some reason, I don't know, but we'll see. See what happens. So I'm just coming out the itching. Absolutely gorgeous. And there's uh, there's Dockhead. Bring it on, right? Literally minutes away where I want to fish. So uh, I'll get set up and uh, talk to you chaps in a bit. Bring it on. Well, anchor's in, just done the first cast. Bit breezy from the west here, but uh, not too bad at all, to be fair. I think I had a little rattle on the, uh, the furthest rod there, within about five minutes, but uh, uh, there it goes, there it goes. Probably a bass, but I'm not gonna. Oh, go on, Woo he? <laughs> He's taken, well, look at him go. Happy days, right, I better look at that, am I? Put, put the GoPro, oh there, yeah, look at him go. Right, let's see what's happening. That was, oh, and again, go on then. Yeah, fish on. Probably a bass, feels like it's swimming, or it could, could be a smut. Probably is, it's probably going to just come on top of the other line, probably just about to hook it as well, the other line. Yeah, it's caught me other line, it's gone on top. Ah, oh, typical. Let's see if I can get it in a little bit quicker before it does. It's probably, yeah, it's caught the other line. There's the leader, he's swimming right up top. What we got, a smut or a, a, smut or a bass? Oh, black bream. <laughs> That'll do me. Go on, get under there. Oh, is he still tangled? Yeah, he is. Nice, sizable black bream. That certainly makes a change, doesn't it? Right, let's get him in. Nice one. Nice little black bream. Beautiful. Swallowed the sakuma. I can get him out, no trouble at all, and get him back. Happy days. First cast. He. Bring it on. Oh, 
Well, that little brat bream went 15 ounces, just shy of a pound, so I'm really pleased with that first drop. Not bad for up here. It's uh, just going to check the other rod now. I did have a couple of little rattles, but I don't think there's anything there. Yeah, so I'm still using the old uh, leaded booms. I'm pleased with that, but I've just dropped to a two hook uh, boom on this one with the leaded weights. No, nothing on here. No. So yeah, so if you can see that there, let's uh, get that in a little bit more. So I've gone to a two hook boom on this one, and that, as I say, has got the uh, little leaded booms. And that's working a treat, especially in a minute, because that tide's going to really uh, ebb in a bit. So that should keep it pinned nicely. So yeah, happy days. Right, let's get it back out there. Brilliant. Right, let's have another bait check. Uh, yeah, a bit slow, really. A couple of little rattles. Here we go, something on there now. rattling away, I don't know what it is. I don't know. Something half decent maybe. Little tiny tiny little sort of like rattles so let's just hope it stays deep. It's promising then if it does but we'll see. I've seen the odd little bite on each of the rods but Be another bream to be fair the way that's rat shaking its head then staying deep fortunately oh <laughs> and there we go pressure off it's only a tiddler but it's a soul look at that greedy git has taken both hooks incredible there we go first sole that's one hook out <laughs> look at that he swallowed both hooks um, there we go there we go first slip of the night hopefully there'll be more but pressure off bring it on look at that lovely Well, I've just had a few more rattles on this one, so I think I'm going to have a early check on this. A bit of weed on the surface now, but uh, not too troublesome at the moment. Right, let's see what's what. Can't feel anything yet. Probably a bit of weed there, I suspect, but no, doesn't feel like anything. But yeah, it was a good old few rattles I was getting. P&O Britannia's just gone out there, you can just see. And that is basically the last of the cruise ships tonight no nothing on it i can tell that oh sir is a <laughs> little little schoolie oh well it's another species tiny little schoolie one for the future happy days gone yeah a little bit of green weed but uh Too much of a problem at the moment. Absolutely cracking worms tonight, as always. It's 
still using a sequin and a stop. Always uh, use that. Yeah, so you don't want that that worm flying uh, back up your rig on the cast, defeating the object. Then, as I say, size fours are a bit fiddly, but once you get once you're used to it, you're used to it. There we go. Right, let's get it back out. All right, let's have another check on this one. See what's happening. Strangely enough, the fish seems to be uh, falling to the running ledger tonight rather than the booms. Whether I'm just landing in where some fish are or who knows. But, but it doesn't feel like anything on here at the moment. few jellyfish running through there. Nah, nothing on here. Nope. A bit of weed off. Ah, it's working good, that's all that matters. But then saying that, I may have left that a little bit long as uh, the old bait has uh, been taken, so. Few of these worms are a bit big for what I'm wanting, but nice. Get that bit of weed off. Yeah, like I said, uh, I like to use the old uh, the Mickey light. Just makes it a little bit more comfortable for the worms on, because otherwise on the feet it can be a little bit slippery. So the we make it like we'll uh, dry them out a little bit and it just makes life uh, easier especially when you're putting them on a size four. There's quite a few jellyfish running through. Right, let's get her back out there. Cool, I didn't take long. Bit of a ratchet screamer then, I heard that going off. Yeah, something there. Oh yeah, here we go. Oh, what we got here? Keep up with it, Dobbo. What we got here? God, that absolutely... Smut. Something swimming, I think. Unless it's half decent bass, who knows? Oh, 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 <laughs> Happy days. Come on. I reckon this could be a be nice if it's a nice half decent bass. Just Oh there it goes. Wants to turn. I'm trying to do it quite quick to keep up with it. But when it does want to turn, it can. It might look like I'm bullying the fish, but I'm not. Mind you, famous last words. Let's see if these size four hooks can hold. Once again, I've got no net. Let me see how big it is first. <laughs> Staying nice and deep. It'd be nice if it ain't a smut. Staying a bit deep for a bass, to be fair. That is really powering up in that tide. Hopefully you can see all this. That's straight down, there's the leader, what we got? Oh, <laughs> and it is epoxy smooth hand and it ain't even worth... Look at that. Give me a heart attack, you git. Oh. oh well. It is what it is. That's where I get bloody wet now, just for epoxy smooth hand. Right, grab it. Just in the scissors of the mouth. Come on. There we go. Have a quick look. Go on, piss off, you bugger. 
he's gone. Right. Got me going. Let's get it back down there. Right, it's a really beautiful evening now. Getting a few little touches. Might have something on here, I don't know. See that it's a bit of weed, but don't feel like much. So it's just starting to flood a little bit. Just take your time. Could be something there. Probably a little bass or something, I expect. Definitely something there. Yeah, a little bass. As I say, it's not exactly fast and furious again. But it's target achieved, but it'd be nice just to see something else. If not, I might just uh, might make a little, just a little move. Sometimes that can uh, just produce the extra fish. In fact, I think that's what I'll do. Let's have a check on this one. Definitely something on here. Another bass. Very small, whatever it is, if there is anything there. Yeah, he's there. Come on then, what is it? Bass. It's gonna stay deep, surprise me. That is staying deep, to be fair. Go on then, what we got? Is it what we want? <laughs> no, it ain't, it's pal. <laughs> oh, well, another species. <laughs> Come here. There we go. Another pal. Well, I think I'm still going to make a just a quick move and uh, see what happens. Right, let's get that anchor up. So I've just made a move, been here probably about 20 odd minutes. Uh, well, near a half an hour, I expect. Um, and just uh, see what's going to happen. I say, it just went deadly quiet there, to be fair. Oh, I've seen a couple of little rattles on this. something here it could be weed there was a bit of weed when I first put the anchor in so it could be weed on here I definitely have seen some rattles so we'll uh, see how we do bit of weed quite possibly a little bit of weed on the lead there. Bait hasn't really gone, so right, let's uh, let's get this one back down there. Let's have another check on this one. A little weight on here, but I'm sure that I think quite possibly weed's gone down here. It could be spider crabs. There has been a few spider crabs. Nah, it's probably weed. Weed and a small bass, <laughs> very small. Well, I'll give it a little while here, and uh, if this weed gets a little bit too persistent, then I can always move again. As I say, I've had the sole, so if it does go quiet when you have had your target fish, you know, you can basically move around a bit. So, but uh, let's get that one back down. Well, I'm just gonna go for another bait check a 
bit of weight oh, a uh, bit of weight with a uh, with a bit of a fight then ah good something on it Whatever it is, it's moved me. It's tangled me up. There we go. What we got? Got bass. Ah, slightly bigger bass. That's better. Only just lip hooked. Come here, you bugger. You gonna let me? There we go. Ah, good couple of pounds. Nice, go on. Right. That made a change. Happy days. Let's get it back down there. Just gonna have a check on this one now after that bass. A little bit of weight there. Can't feel it doing much. Weed. Getting heavier? No. Weed and completely stripped. Right, get it back down. Don't take long for the old bait checks to come around, so there's something bouncing away there during that cast. I mean, there's, yeah, there's definitely something on there, but. I don't think it's worth getting too excited about. There's the leader, what we got? Seems to have found a little bass spot here, which I certainly don't want. I'll give it one more cast here and then I'm gonna move back up again, I think. There he goes, happy days. Still got plenty of worm. Beautiful. Oh, it's a lovely evening now. The old water's nice and clear. Cool. Right. Let's check the other one. Doesn't feel like anyone, anything on this one, I don't think. 
Nah, there ain't. No, bait's still going though. No. Right, let's get it back down there. <coughs> well, once again, it's it's gone slow again now. Yeah, very strange up here at the moment. No, nothing on this one. No, bait's not even touched on that one there. Look at that. Oh well. I'd say I'm probably only going to give it until about 11. It's not exactly fast and furious. And, uh, so I've got another hour to go anyway, so right, let's get it back out. Oh, I don't know. Something on here, little pout or something, just feel it flicking. Oh, it's getting uh, is it getting heavier? Oh, go on then. <laughs> another another large-ish pout for Southampton water. Uh, bigger than the last one. Not what we wanted. There we go. Right. Let's get back out again. Well, welcome back, that's it. So that's my last uh, cast done. Let's have a quick bait check and uh, I think I'm gonna call that it. No, doesn't feel like anything at all. Very, very strange. Fishing, yeah, it's just not fishing at all this year. This time last year, you know, you were getting lots of fish, and I'm not just talking, you know, you were getting quite a few soul, you know, per trip. Um, but I just don't mean just soul. It just seems to be anything. Well, at the moment, it's you're lucky to uh, to get a bite. Very strange. Right, let's quickly do this one. And I can pack them up and uh, I've got quite a bit of weight on this one. Uh, it's gone lighter. Or has it? There's fish on here, I think. Yeah, there is. Go on. Oh, yeah, go on. Go on, then. This could be what we're after. This could be what we're after. That's getting heavy and it's staying deep. Go on. This feels like a good fish, whatever it is. Is it what we want? Don't think it is. It's now. So, whoa! Go on, go on. There's a leader. Nice bass. That's a lovely bass. That is a cracker. Ah. That's quite li one, two, three. Oh yeah. That's a nice bass. Very short and stumpy, but that's a that's a good fish. That is a nice, nice fish. Happy days. Right, I'm going to clean up, get everything put away, and uh, I'll speak to you in a bit. Tickety boo. Well, welcome back. 
back, that's me done then. All packed up, all cleaned, all happy days.